Hello, welcome. <laughs> hey everybody, I've been so looking forward to this moment. Months of preparation and discussions and stuff have led up to this moment and I really wanted to share it with you. We are going to open the contents of this bag. I think a lot of you already know that I have teamed up with artist and designer Evelina Demoray on a project. I feel totally honored to have been able to make this thing with her. This is our this is our love child. She is a multi-talented woman for who I have much respect. Really truly is an honor to have created this beautiful thing with her. Anyway, so this bag contains a handbag, a little little handbag. I haven't seen the real thing yet. It just got to me. Oh, I can't believe I can't believe it's really here. Okay, okay. Should we just should we just open it? So the idea behind this is that it's a handbag version of me. <laughs> it's like if I were a bag this is what it would look like, okay? Uh, you might know that I like bags. I have far too many, if such a thing is possible. But this bag promises to be way cooler than all the others and quite a lot more special. So let's have a look at it. Thank you for joining me on this momentous occasion. Oh, come on. Paper seems to go on forever. Oh, 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 oh. There's more paper on the strap. Uh, Oh my god, it's really here. It's really here. It's really real. I'm holding it. That's nuts. Ladies and gentlemen of the Belfry, I present to you the Black Friday bag. <laughs> Look at it. It smells new. Ooh, the inside is like really soft and what a nice color. Also, you might have noticed I wear a lot of black, only black, and I like little pops of red sometimes. So I really wanted this bag to be totally black with a little pop of red. That's the inside of it there and it's this really like sumptuous, smooth velvet. Actually quite a lot of space inside. Like you can take the straps off this and it becomes like a clutch bag, but it's really like a handbag. You wear it over your shoulder and it's a good size actually. I wanted it to look really cool but also have like enough space in it to be practical for all your stuff that you need to bring with you, like the right amount of makeup and stuff. Let's have a look. Look at that. Black Friday by Avelina Demoray. And it's got a makeup mirror, which fuck yeah. That's so fucking useful. Scares my blue language. There is so much going on here. I'm going to describe it to you. Well, I mean, you can see, but let's have a look. So the flap is a bat wing. It's a bit special. It's made of black PVC and it's padded. It's quilted so that like it, it's a little bit 3D. You see that? Oh, isn't that cool? This part here I think is faux suede and it sort of curls around a little bit like a real bat wing. The body is vegan leather. The whole thing is vegan materials, by the way. I wanted this to have my favorite materials on it, so like velvet or suede and PVC because those fabrics are blacker than other blacks. And the faux leather makes it strong and solid and just so sophisticated and stylish, but also really Badass, look at it, shit. On the back there is a pocket and the zip is a little cross. Let's open it up. And this pocket is lined with red satin. Perfect for keeping your keys in. Oh, it's so solid, I like that. And it's got this inside pocket which is also a cross. Pretty cool. The zips are really solid. I think they're gonna last a long time. And I wanted the strap to be nice and comfortable and adjustable and kind of not too wide and also removable so you can just carry it as a clutch bag if you like or you can wear it as a shoulder bag. So let's try it on. It feels so right. I can't get over how cool this is. Oh my God. I didn't realize how fancy the buckle was. Look, this is the buckle on the strap that goes over your shoulder. I didn't realize how cool that was. What a nice shape. But the other obvious details, there's this epic row of spikes across the top and this symbol on the corner here in silver the symbol is very important to me maybe you've noticed i wear it quite a lot this is the sigil of lucifer it is not an evil symbol a lot of people think that it's not an evil symbol i do not wear evil symbols because i am not evil for me the sigil represents a search for enlightenment wisdom and ownership over one's own life so it was very important for me to have the symbol on the mini bag but if you want this bag and the symbol really bothers you for religious reasons or whatever you can specify 
dye in your order that you just don't want it there, that's fine and it's no problem. So when Evelina and I set out to design this bag, kind of the idea behind it was that it should be something that's sophisticated, something that's spooky, and it's something that's just totally rad. Something that looks good with every outfit, something that's practical. She is an amazing designer, I don't know how she does it, I'm not good at that kind of thing. So when we first started talking about what the bag should look like, we talked on Skype for hours, like hours and hours. And I said like, oh, uh, I would, mm, I don't really know, I'm not very good at this. I, I would kind of like it to be, have like this and have this and maybe, you know, it should have that and that. She was like, yeah, sure. And just, you know, took it away. And then shortly afterwards presented me with this design idea that I was like, wow, that's so cool. That's like perfect. So I loved her original idea, but over time we tweaked it a bit and made it more badass. <laughs> well, it is a thing of wonder and beauty. I Oh. I'm so proud of how this has turned out like it looks really good and I'm not just saying that like it really does look really good If I saw this in a shop, I would buy it like it's got everything on it that I like which was kind of the point of it really <laughs> So we worked really hard on this bag and I hope that you guys will love it These are now officially on pre-sale in Evelina's shop, which I will link below for you. They're not cheap They're kind of like a high-end item. So I'm just oh, I feel so honored. I Like how much this looks like blood I swear it isn't. The price on the website is in Australian dollars and it's 139 Australian dollars, which is 109 US dollars. 84 pounds or 93 euros. And there's a nice lay-by option if you want it, but you'd rather pay it off in chunks rather than all at once. And all you need for that is PayPal, I believe. You know, it's kind of a high-end item and it's not being mass-produced on a huge scale, so not everyone will have one. It's a fancy item. It's something that should last you a very, very long time. It's something that you want to treasure. Like, you go to festivals and parties and you see the same bags floating around everywhere. Everyone's got the same ones, which is fine, but this one's a bit special. This one's a bit special. It's cooler than all those other bags and sexier. And wearing it makes you cooler and sexier. I feel cooler and sexier right now. So right now, these beautiful bags Oh my god, beautiful. Sorry, I'm just, I still can't believe. It's for pre-sale on the website. And in order for production to start on the bags, there needs to be a minimum number of pre-orders. So the sooner you order, the sooner everyone gets their bag. And lots of you have already placed pre-orders because you have very good taste. <laughs> Do we have a bit of a closer look at it or should I try it on? I want to try it on. Let's try it on. So the strap is already at like the right length for me and the strap is really soft. Like a lot of the time when you get a new shoulder bag, the strap will be all like folded up and really stiff, but it's not. It's soft. So yeah, and the straps go on and off so you can use it as a clutch bag or a shoulder bag, whatever you prefer. The spikes look so fucking cool. Like they're, you know, they're big and awesome, but they're not, they're not in the way or something, you know? and they don't make it hard to open it or something. This makeup mirror is super useful because normally I pack a little mirror with me, but I guess I won't have to, will I? So I'll just put in a few of the things that I usually bring out with me. Lipstick I have on at the moment, powder, eyeliner, my wallet. Pretty cool wallet, huh? Hey, if you guys really love this bag, we might eventually make a matching wallet in the future, if you so wish. I would go get my keys to put in, but Matthias has lost them for me, so. And it has these two buttons here for doing it up securely because I like my bag to feel secure. There we go. Ta-da! And again. So yeah, I guess this is like the must-have super stylish uber goth bag for your essentials. Ah! Look at it! I love how this is slightly padded. Like, it's a 3D bat wing and there are spikes and there's my favorite sigil and just... I just love it. It is amazing. It is me as a bag. So yeah, the Black Friday by Evelina Demore handbag is officially launched. And I like that. It's official. It's really, really happening. So if you want to get one of these for yourself or for someone who you think would love it, I will link below to Evelina's shop where you can find it. It's the only place you can find it. I am truly honored to have been a part of this collaboration. I just think this is so cool. This is beautiful. I can't wait to take it out into the world and show it off and try it out. And it would make me so proud and warm in the heart to see people walking around carrying this bag that like her and I put so much love and thought into. You might have noticed I'm a bit of a fashion enthusiast. This is so cool, I just, ah, the Black Friday bag is in the world and uh, you can have one. <laughs> just to reiterate, 100% vegan, totally vegan and cruelty free, sophisticated, badass fucking bag. <laughs> I really hope you guys will love it. It is 
kind of a little bit nerve-wracking showing people your creation for the first time. I mean, I don't take that much credit for this. This is Avelina's work, okay? Uh, she's amazing, all right? She's such an amazing designer. She's a great artist. She's an inspiring woman. She's also made a video about launching this bag, which I will link below for you too. It's really a special thing for me, and thank you so much for joining me. Like, I don't have any merchandise. I'm getting some, okay? I'm working on that at the moment. I swear to God, I promise, it's coming. <laughs> but like, I want to make sure that I'm selling good merchandise. Like, I don't want to just, you know, sign up with some random online thing and be firing out stuff that's not good. I want to make sure it's good. Okay, I'm not putting my name on something that I don't think is good. But yeah, today, officially, we have the beautiful handbag. So yeah, whether or not you're as excited about handbags as I am, I don't know. But thank you very much for joining me on this special occasion. It's kind of a big deal. Anyway, if you have not already done so, please hit the red button below and subscribe to my lovely spooky channel. I hope you have a great weekend. And as always, take care of yourselves, be nice to each other, and I will see you next time. Bye! <laughs>